Alright. Garbodor. Your toxic spikes were, were foiled by your trainer's lack of experience. Apparently sending out a Venusaur completely invalidates them. Also, we sent you out against Pokemon with high horsepower. We didn't know that. That was rough. But still, even so, at like 50 HP, you got like 3 attacks off and almost saved the entire run. You're such a beast. We only got to use you once, but dang, you did good. Firo, you took out like 3 Pokemon. What a beast. I can't believe you're outspeeded by that Servine thing. I guess its speed is just insane. So our strategy was not not a good one. Um, we should have given you agility. Had your agility once, and then did the dual wing beat. But it's the, is the issue is it's ten percent chance to miss, and we we used it like eight or nine times. You did miss once, but we were a little too reliant on that. Honeybee, you had some potential. You're very very strong. Does do a lot of damage, but you're in nothing compared to Leaf Storm. Contrary, unfortunately. Gino, our shiny Pokemon. Ah. Oh. You were so bad matchup wise against like everybody we fought, so we barely got to use you, which sucked because you were a shiny. But you got to be the last one in the fight against Erica. You got to be so close to winning. Red HP toxic. Oh, if only we had like protect on you or something, you would have won that. It would have been so, so cool. We could have rebuilt the squad after winning. So, Ozbuck, we really wanted to switch into you with Maze the uh, grass type move, but we didn't we didn't get that to happen. It would have been so good if Snivy had a choice scarf on it, and that's why I went first. Because then you would have just gotten to heal and uh, power up five, four turns in a row against Snivy. That would have been so good. You were close. Gengar, you got outspeeded, and the Toxic Spike plan foiled your Venoshock, unfortunately. That was so rough. If everybody on his team got poisoned, you're really fast. Poison Barb, Venoshock would have been insane. You would have like one shot everybody. Went crazy. It was a good plan. I just didn't know about whatever Venusaur thing destroyed my toxic spikes. Um, Mr. Mime, you changed the field. It's pretty cool. Reef, we never really got to use you, but your priority moves pretty good. These Pokemon didn't actually die, by the way. Jules, we never got to use you, but huge power is sick. If you'd evolved for Whitney, you'd been good. Nanny, your Earthquake was awesome against uh, Surge. I just don't like you as a Pokemon, I'm sorry. You're a Fire-type, you're only Fire-type, and then you didn't even make the top 6 for Erica. Balloon, I really wish you started with Pickup, but we got it on you eventually, and got Bottle Caps, and that contributed to our success quite a bit. So, you are pretty valuable. For the Pidgey Rattata bush, you're still pretty valuable. If only you had Pickup earlier, though, you would have been really good. Artillery, we never used you. Yeah. Skill link's cool, but you just you're not good enough for late game, I don't think. Quagsire, we Oh, I was gonna say we never used you, but we used you for Damp Thief to get some weakness policies. That was sweet. Because those uh those uh grabblers were really scary with self destruct. So you were able to yoink the weakness policies without dying. Pitcher Chin, we never used you, and we hate you. Because of Surge. It's probably not your fault, but you know. Surge sends you out, and we hate you. Well, I don't think we ever got to use you either, but I really like uh, Electrode in this game. Uh, this The uh, Electro Ball is really cool. Charge Beam's good. You've got Static. You've got that ability that makes Tri, tri Attack an Electric move, which would have been sick. If we got if you'd evolved before Misty, we'd have got to use you, and you'd been cool. Okay, and then the Pokemon that died throughout the run. Malcolm, MVP of the entire run. You were so, so strong. Um, I really regret switching to you and having you lose a fight because of that. That was that was a shame. Oh, we leveled you up. We got you Crunch for Morty. You did good. It's too bad you had to die through it, but Arcanine is such a good Pokemon. Bernie, your, your ability to half physical damage or whatever is crazy. You're so tanky. We used you in multiple fights. You were valuable. We never had you be the star of the fight, but you were always, if someone else fails, you come out and clean up, and you did your job. Good work. Brawly? I really wish you'd evolved for Whitney, because you'd have really shined in that fight. But, you know, you got a little bit of use out. You did some stuff. You had Bite against Morty, and that was your best move. Wish you could have gotten a little bit of better move set there, but, you know, you did, you did enough. Azrael, huge power. So cool. Fairy type in this game. Cool, cool. 
Unfortunately, we didn't realize Drain Kiss was special and used it and threw. Unlucky. Crush. Last run, you weren't really... You were kind of outshined by um, the other Pokemon of your type. This run, you outshined them. Um, your Swift Swim was crazy with Pelipper. Your moveset's good. You had Strong Jaw when we wanted it. We switched your ability at the right time. All in all, good. It's too bad you can't learn, like, uh, Thunder Fang and stuff, but that's, that's so cool. Pelipper. I hate Wingles. I'm sorry. You get a really good ability in this game, though, and... Your typing's pretty good and everything. Your stats aren't terrible. Your moveset is awesome. So you're, you're valued Pokemon on the team. Even though I just have a hatred of Mingles. Game Drill. I think your early game, you're just like mistyped for everything that we fought. And that was your strong point. Uh, the only other chance really for you was super late game when we get Mega Evolution. Because I think your Mega Form is really strong. So I was really looking forward to trying that out, but we never got there, unfortunately. I do think Beedrill is a cool Pokemon, it's just... You don't have a good moveset, you don't have good stats, you don't have good typing. It's really hard to make it work. And we never taught you any beams, so we probably should have named you Beam Drill, but... I did have a Beedrill, I named Beam Drill, that had like Signal Beam and Solar Beam and two other Beam moves, so it was really cool. Our starter, DJ Grill. You were supposed to show... Our mod, DJ Grill, what moves Ivysaur can get now that it's not Gen 1, but you didn't live long enough to. We actually had you die before Misty on just like a trainer that gives you dig. It was pretty sad. Pretty sad indeed. You didn't even get to beat Misty. You were going to destroy her. That was kind of the whole point. But, oh well. And Diana, our very first death on Brock. A bitty run. That's rough. A really cool Pokemon though. Fortunately, only you and Slowpoke are like in in uh in Viridian, just you and Slowpoke are there. So I think if we do non-randomized runs, we're gonna be seeing way too much of you. So it actually was kind of good that you died early on, because you know, we're probably gonna see way too much of you. But Volt Absorb is really sweet too, so you can you can actually be a water type and fight surge, which is pretty cool. Like, you can be an electric type, you can be a water type, and you can actually fight search. So most electric types just don't have the move coverage to fight search, because they're just pure electric. Electric. But yeah, that, uh, that ends it for you guys, unfortunately. Ripperonis. Time to reset. <laughs>